And welcome back to Top Entrepreneur. My name is John DePietro. It's a pleasure to welcome you. We've got a great show today. And obviously our products are working because there are photos everywhere and there are frogs running rampant <laughs> in the studio. This is the segment where our panel of experts gets to ask specific pointed business questions of our contestants. Let's turn it over to Fern. Okay, Brian, Anna, great stuff. I love both your products. It's exciting. Uh, Brian, I just have a question for you regarding your, um, some of the things you mentioned before about Year of the Frog. I know uh, from the environmental standpoint that there's a huge outrage going on about what's happening to frogs all over the world. Right. Have you um, done anything with tapping in on some of that, the concern, the, uh, the national and international concern about frogs being a dying species or dying all over the world? Yeah, we've been in contact with the Association of Zoos and Aquariums. We've been on the uh, in contact with a lot of the biologists. So there's a foundation called Save the Frogs. We're on their web page um, as a recommended purchase for them. Good. We've gotten tremendous support uh, all across the, the board. Even a senator in the state of Maine is trying to push it to make it Great. code for the state, as well as Groton, Massachusetts oh. has made it code for the city code, of Groton. That's to, where if I was you going. have a pool, Fabulous. you have to have a critter skimmer in. So that's, we're trying to push yeah. that. So you're doing a lot of cross-marketing, which is absolutely fabulous. We're, we're hidden everywhere. That's great. And Anna, um, are, regarding what you're doing right now with this beautiful concept that you have and Rockport being the, the heart of art and galleries and so forth, have you thought about getting your product out into other galleries at all? Have you thought about that? We have. Uh, we're actually, there are several opportunities to display artwork. Um, in several different locations around town. Right now, we just launched the company in November, right. um, and because it was a little too late for print ads for Christmas, and we really didn't think the company was going to take off as quickly as it did, mm -hmm. we've been focused primarily on the web, uh, but we have now, we've joined our local chamber of commerce, we're Good. handing out flyers, we're going to approach interior designers and realtors. You both have great area. websites, by the way. I've looked at oh, both of your websites and they're very absolutely. impressive. I know that both my colleagues have also looked at them too. My and I'm just wondering, have you done anything with um, Facebook and Twitter and all Absolutely. That? We are on yep. Facebook, we are on Twitter, uh, we have a blog, okay. we've done a lot of social media. We actually uh, were in several uh, large blogs for the holidays, for Christmas gifts, will be in for Valentine's Day gifts. Right, we so had you a have TV a, spot. You have a choice of four different products right now that you, four different results. Four different you. styles, you, correct. Is that picture behind you demonstrating the different results or that's No, this is just one. This is our pop art style. Pop art. Okay. Yes. Okay, thank you. What do you think? David, uh, if I may. Hi. Yes. Steve Rocher, uh, great products. And, Steve's and, from Bay State Savings, by yeah. the way. Uh, Brian, uh, why can't another company just uh, come up and start this, I think it's a great idea, and you probably every pool in the country is going to have one, and why not? But why can't somebody else just uh, manufacture this and put it in, why do they have to buy from you? Well, we have patents currently in United States, Canada, and in Australia. So it's patented. Um, <clears throat> we, when this was, I made it because I had a problem. My adopted father is a retired judge. He saw it within 15 seconds, told me we're going to go see somebody and get patent protection, great. and we did. So we're protected awesome. as best you can right yeah. now legally. So Steve, now you're asking legal questions. You're yeah. the bank. No, I had <laughs> that was my question. Well, that was Jeff. Uh, okay, now let's stick from, to the dollars from a, and cents. From a financial okay, point, I mean, if you get sued, I'm in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so, and, but I mean, I think it's a great idea. Uh, Anna, I love your uh, product as well, and uh, I'm an amateur photographer, so I think it's great. Uh, what makes you different? Uh, you know, what are some of your strengths? Quality. We have very strong quality. Also, the, the there are other companies out there who are doing what we do, um, but they don't have the quality, the quality of material and the quality of craftsmanship and the artistry. That's really what we're uh, setting ourselves apart with. Awesome. Is quality. Uh, and uh, still on the legal uh, issues, do you use any proprietary software in producing these print uh, portraits? Or is it all off-the-shelf software? It's pretty much off-the-shelf so software, but okay. our process is a unique process. And you haven't done anything to patent it or anything like that? It's a more trade secret type of approach? It's more of a trade secret thing. I, I, there really is no way to patent it because most of the, the software is off-the-shelf, okay. but the way that it's used is because of the expertise. And you've developed that internally. You didn't have a, a consultant no, or an independent contractor. No, everything. The, the entire company has been just my husband and I, copywriting, website, okay. graphics, everything. Okay. Okay. One last, uh, do we have time? One last question for you. Uh, your digipix.us, yes. 
naturally we would have gone to digipix.com as our initial jump, right? We also see, own the dot .com. Oh, you do also own, we own So there's Digi not another entity out there that's also called Digipix that you could be confused Digi with? Well, Digi there is a Digipix. Okay. Um, it is a photography studio. Okay. Uh, it's not very well advertised. We also do own digipixus.com. Okay. So that if people are confused and they want to put a dot .com on it, they will still be able to find but us. Everything's redirected back. Right. And have we you traded marked your we are the in the process okay. of it. Like I said, we just launched in November. Didn't expect the right. results that we're getting. But that's good so results. Fast. That's good. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. That's good. That's <laughs> great. Nice problem to have. Yeah. Right. 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 Um, We've got time for one yeah, more. Brian, uh, are you working with, um, you might have said this already, but are you working with um, pool companies, installation companies that are doing pools around the yes. country yet? Most of our focus has been attending the pool shows that we've gone to. We're shows, actually attending yeah. one next week in Atlantic City. Uh, in Las Vegas, we were voted best new product at the International Pool Show last right. year. Um, so we're we're hitting the servicing people, the right. pool stores, and the internet as well. How about resorts? Um, have you gone in that direction at That's all? A, it's a slippery slope with resorts because it's commercial and the uh -huh. lids are larger. Um, we oh. would like to eventually branch out to resorts because we've been requested, but it's a larger uh, cover and we need a lar we need a new mold you for that a format for that. Great. One. Thank you, okay. experts. Great stuff. I would suggest that you folks have a lot of work to do during the break to come up with some yes, we do. Uh, top entrepreneur today. And during the time that we've been on, we have collected 142 frogs. <laughs> and we're going to be cooking them during the break and come back and frog legs for everyone when top entrepreneur continues. <laughs>